Okay, let's talk about how to use a novel log today. So this is your novel log pen, and you will use a pen needle. So this is your abdomen I'm going to consider, and this is where you can inject around your thigh, well, upper thigh, and this is your abdomen. Please make sure you do not inject very near to your umbilicus, the upper buttocks, and the back of your uh, upper arm. Now let's talk about uh, how to do this. Your doctor will advise you how to take this. You need to make sure that you follow the instructions very carefully. So let's say you're going to take 10 units of insulin. In this case, you're going to dial up to 10 units. And then you take your the cap of the pen. And this is your pen needle. All you have to do is screw that pen needle with the cap on onto your pen and after this you will be able to pull the cap back and there will be another cap which you will have to take off until you see the pen needle now you're ready you have to make sure that you can do priming with two units of insulin you'll see some insulin coming out as you can see it'll drop and then after this you're ready and then all you have to do is to dial up. Let's say you're going to take 10 units. Remember, Novolog is an insulin that you take before meals or occasionally with a sliding scale when your blood sugars are high. So what you're going to do here, after you dial up the, the pen, you go directly to your skin onto a clean skin. You will inject it directly 90 degrees and you will push the plunger in. And then it's recommended generally 5 to 10 seconds to wait until it's totally delivered and then you pull it back. At this point you will have to take the pen needle off, put the next container that is safe with a lid and then you are ready for your next injection. Remember the action of Novolog is around 3 to 4 hours. It starts working in 10 to 15 minutes. It peaks around 90 minutes. And then the effect disappears in 3 to 4 hours. So you do not want to inject Novolog every hour because that can cause accumulation of Novolog in your system and can lead to severe hypoglycemia, which is low blood sugars. So make sure you have an endocrinologist or a diabetes specialist helping you deal with the insulin, especially if you are having trouble controlling your blood sugars. Thank you for watching.